Top 4, a fifth grader is being called a piano prodigy. You probably haven't heard her name yet, but wait until you hear her play. It is pretty incredible. Karen Hensel has this young musician's story in tonight's 7 Spotlight. Jody Brielle Brown already knows what she wants to do when she grows up. Well, I would like to be a famous concert pianist um, and a doctor. Her career in medicine may still be years away, but this 10-year-old's musical journey is already being written one note at a time. In my teaching uh, experience, and I've been teaching for over 20 years, I only came across two musical prodigies, and Jody's one of them. They're very rare, one in a million. Here it comes. <gasps> Attention. Elena Fomicheva, a classically trained pianist herself, is Jody's longtime piano teacher. Energy. Yeah. Piano to me basically means joy, and I want to bring music into the world. Jody has been bringing music into the world since she was five years old. But believe it or not, when she first started... I did not think I was good at it. I just couldn't get it. I just didn't get it. Now, at age 10, not only does Jody get it, it's her passion. I love playing piano for the crowds. I pretend like it's just me and the piano, like I'm just practicing at home. And Jody has played in some pretty impressive places. I played in the birthplace of Mozart, which is uh, Salzburg, Austria. And at Carnegie Hall in New York City twice. Um, when I think about like Carnegie Hall, I just thank God for giving me the gift and putting Miss Elena into my life because I wouldn't be where I am now without Miss Elena and God. So show me the dancey arms. <laughs> Good. She just booms, she just gets it, you know, from one lesson to another. She learns real quick. Build up, she understands. Jody, her rare talent, she feels the music. Jody says she practices piano every day, and her hard work has paid off. She has won national and international awards. Last year, she became the first classical pianist from Florida to take home the top prize in the Music International Grand Prix. As for where she stacks up against others her age... She's the best in South Florida. Sure. I've got no doubt. Right now, I'm not sure if I would consider myself a piano prodigy because, I mean, I'm still young and I'm still learning. As for what the future may hold... That's basically, like, my dream to go to Juilliard, uh, to just study music and be a composer when I grow up and a doctor. Mm -hmm.